Hacking is a multifaceted term that can refer to various activities involving unauthorized access to computer systems, networks, and data. Whether hacking is a must-learn skill depends on the context and your intentions. Ethical hacking, also known as white hat hacking, involves legally and responsibly testing the security of computer systems, networks, and applications. Ethical hackers are cybersecurity professionals who use their skills to identify vulnerabilities and weaknesses, helping organizations improve their security measures. Unethical hacking, black hat, hacking refers to malicious activities where individuals exploit security vulnerabilities for personal gain, to cause harm, or to gain unauthorized access. Engaging in such activities is illegal and unethical. Skill development. Learning hacking skills can be beneficial for those pursuing careers in cybersecurity, IT, or related fields. Understanding how hackers operate can help security professionals better defend against potential threats. Legal and ethical considerations. Hacking without proper authorization is illegal and can lead to serious consequences. It's important to learn hacking skills within a legal and ethical framework. Positive intent. If you're interested in ethical hacking and cybersecurity, acquiring hacking skills can be valuable. Learning about vulnerabilities, exploits, and defensive measures can contribute to a safer digital environment. Hackers can be classified into seven categories based on their intentions and motivations. White Hat Hackers. These are ethical hackers who work to identify and fix security vulnerabilities. They help organizations strengthen their security measures and protect against cyber threats. Black Hat Hackers. These are malicious hackers who exploit vulnerabilities for personal gain, financial profit, or to cause harm. They engage in illegal activities, such as stealing sensitive information or launching cyber attacks. Gray Hat Hackers. These fall between white hat and black hat hackers. They may hack without proper authorization but without malicious intent. They often expose vulnerabilities to the affected parties without causing harm. Hacktivists. These are individuals or groups who hack for political or social causes. They use hacking as a form of protest or to raise awareness about specific issues. Script kiddies. These individuals lack advanced technical skills and use pre-written scripts or tools to carry out hacking activities. They often have limited understanding of the underlying technology. State-sponsored hackers. Governments or state entities engage in hacking for espionage, cyber warfare, or political purposes. State-sponsored hacking can have serious geopolitical implications. Hackers for hire. Some hackers offer their services for a fee, engaging in activities such as hacking social media accounts or websites on behalf of clients. In conclusion, hacking is not a must-learn skill in the sense of engaging in illegal activities. However, understanding hacking concepts and cybersecurity can be valuable for those pursuing careers in IT and cybersecurity. Ethical hacking has a legitimate place in the digital landscape, as it helps identify vulnerabilities and protect against cyber threats. It's essential to approach hacking with a responsible and legal mindset, adhering to ethical standards and promoting a safer online environment. Subscribe to stay smarter than the rest.